Hi, Alice Michelle here with video number three, Get the Book Launch, Discovering Ways to Reinvent Invent Yourself Today. Again, I'm Alice Michelle, author and social media branding expert. Um, as you guys know, I have women leaders, creative entrepreneurs, um, creative anybody really to do, uh, to learn how to personal brand themselves using social media or finding other ways to reinvent themselves so that they're able to promote themselves, get their brand out there, and show people what their products can do and how important their products are. So with what is the topic? What taught me use what works, which is social media. Very easy. I know people have been so apprehensive about social media, when they should use it, when they should not use it. But did you know people like you are using social media to promote who they are and what they do every single day? So I ask, why are you not doing it? It's a simple little thing to incorporate into your professional development or into your marketing effort for your business. Why social media? It makes communication with like-minded professionals easy, okay? It's a place where people who think like you, who are interested in the same things like you, are hanging out. So why not communicate with them? And social media uh, networking sites such as Facebook make it very easy to make that communication happen. Always, it also allows you to educate your followers on what you're interested in. Now, you see, you can actually share content with other people. You can share with them what you just finished reading. You can show them tutorials that has helped you um, become a better professional. I mean, it's easy, guys. Another way is that it generates a buzz about your creative talents. Whatever those creative talents might be, it's a way to get people out there uh, knowing what you do, showcasing what you do. Uh, it's very easy to upload photographs of what you're doing. You are actually in action, those kinds of things. So it's a great way just to keep people um, people knowing you, keep your, you fresh, you know, so you can generate the buzz that you need about your product or services or about your uh, professional development. So where do you start? Well, there are social media networks out there, and there's a lot of them. You've heard of Facebook, of course. How many people who have not heard of Facebook? There's Twitter, and there's LinkedIn. Those are considered social media networks out there, and they are very social. Then you've got blogging. Blogging like um, blogger.com, like TypePad and WordPress, where people actually um, write content or share videos and things like that uh, on um, on subject matters that they are interested in and writing about. Um, blogging is, as you may know, started off as an online journal for people to share their ideas and thoughts and opinions with others, where it's taken off and it's a great way to establish yourself as your own author or your own editor of your own content. So I'm a very strong component of blogging. I've been blogging ever since 2004, I think about. So I know it's a great way to... Um, be known out in the in the internet world and to start branding yourself another place you can start is multimedia and multimedia would be interactive kind of things like video and that's for those who are very comfortable in front of the camera but there are other ways you can be um, that you can actually create videos you can use PowerPoint slides uh, and actually uh, record your voice those are types of ways of multimedia ways to actually get started in this personal branding kind of thing. So you might ask, which one should you start with? Because I just list three and my book covers a whole lot more. But if I was to answer a person who says, well, at least where do I start? I will always tell them to start with probably social media networks. It's easy to set up. It's easy to get started. And it's um, a great tool to generate that buzz pretty quickly so um, I recommend either Facebook Twitter or LinkedIn any of one of those three social um, media networks I um, I suggest to start with I do not suggest for you to be on all three I su suggest that you only use one and master that one and get really good at that and then you will feel a lot comfortable because anything other than that will be quite overwhelming how do you become great how do you build this social bond with people um, 
using social networks or social media, you build relationships. And how do you build relationships? You communicate with people. You leave comments on their blogs. You like their blogs. You share their content on Facebook. Um, so that's a way of building relationships. Send an individual email to someone, a personal email to someone saying how much you love their blog and what you got out of it. The other thing was learn from the best. We talked about this in video two. Uh, I still uh, stand by this. Watch what other people are doing on those social media networks and copy what they're doing and put your own little twist on that to emulate what they're doing. Don't recreate the wheel when the wheel is already available. So learn from the best, watch what other people are doing and repeat what they're doing. The third thing is to share content. Share content that you've written, share content that other people have written, share books that you've read. Just share the things that keep you fresh and keep you updated in your profession. The fourth thing is communicate often. And I get a lot of questions about this, about how often should I enter, uh, engage on uh, the social network and the social media? How often should I post? Well, it is great to, to communicate every day. But that might not be realistic for everyone because your schedule is very busy and I totally understand that. So is mine. So I say to communicate between two to three times a week. And I think that's feasible. Uh, if you choose a certain time of day, like early in the morning when you get up and com communicate, post something on your Facebook page, uh, leave a comment on someone, like someone's page, or um, share content from that page, that is a form of building relationships and communicating often so just choose about two to three times a week is what i recommend when you're when you're really good at it and it becomes part of your natural way of communicating with people or another form of networking and communicating with other people then you'll pick up the speed and you'll probably almost be uh, communicating or doing something on those social media uh, sites at least maybe four to five times a week it's amazing it, sometimes it can get addictive but to others, it might not be. So, in the book, Greatness is in the Comeback, this is why we're here, you'll discover that social media isn't a temporary marketing gimmick, but a long-term commitment with invaluable benefits. Now, guys, it's a great tool to be successful. It is an easy tool. Most of them, almost 99% of them are free, so it is a very um, inexpensive tool to market yourself, your brand, your services, and your products. And in the greatness and the comeback, I do offer you the tools and the, and, and the steps uh, and the systems that I've used to actually market myself and reinvent myself using social media. If you watch my other two videos, you know that I got a special offer. So I've got to share the special offer again for those of you who are just finding this video today. The offer is my Kindle version of my book, Greatness is in the comeback is a 99 cent, guys. It is a 99 cent. Now, this offer will not be available um, anytime soon. Um, and this offer ends at 12 o'clock midnight. So if you don't get it, it won't be available. But hey, guys, it's a great gift to share with other people. Uh, you don't need a Kindle per se to actually read my Kindle version book. But uh, you can download it and the people can read it from the computer. Now, you know what? People have been asking me, hey, Lise, is this the only form this book is in? Nope, guys. It's in hardback also. And you can also buy it on Amazon.com. But it's not 99 cents. Uh, I really need for you to buy this 99 cent version. Uh, I'm really trying to go for that Amazon bestseller. So if you can help me out with that, that's great. Um, but soon I have a book signing for those of you who actually want the hard copy version uh, that will be available very soon for those with um, a signed copy. But anyway, thank you again. Don't forget to take uh, advantage of the special offer of the 99 cent Kindle version of Greatness is in the Comeback. And so guys, I see you later with the video number four. Have a great day.